so much about love, it's mostly about a, a piece of chocolate that someone gave me at a party. It turned out not to be chocolate. I'll tell you guys a story. This is, this is the third gig against the guys in the band probably know this already because it uh, makes sense. Normally when I got a band, you don't get the stories behind these tunes, but uh, I'm from Nashville, and a lot of times in Nashville they'll set you up with a handful of other artists, other singer-songwriters, and you kind of sit up in a, in a row. It's called a writer's round, and it's a... Uh, most of the time, a lot of country songwriters uh, in Nashville. And, and one night, I got invited to this uh, kind of red carpet event in Nashville, um, kind of pinkies up, you know, highbrow kind of situation. Um, but it was for a great, great cause, really uh, good charity. And, and the guy who invited me to the party, the host of the party, said, you know, as soon as I got there, I was in this black, black suit and brought my guitar. And he was like, yo, Paul, thank you so much for coming here. You know, uh, you want a beer? You need some you need to drink? You know, can I take care of you? All this stuff. And I said, man, you know, uh, the people that I was playing with that, that evening were uh, really, you know, popular country singers. They were all had trophies and all this kind of stuff, and you'd all know them. And I was like, man, I probably should not do that uh, because I don't want to suck tonight, man. Yeah? Uh, he's like, how about a hit of this weed? And I said, man, I should probably chill on the weed. How about this chocolate? I said, man, I'm cool on the chocolate. He said, take the chocolate. I said, dude. Uh, what are you t He said, the chocolate will make you feel just right. I said, man, I'm cool. He said, take the chocolate. I said, cool, man, it's great to be here. Thank you for having me. I ate that chocolate, dude, and that was not chocolate. Uh, I ended up tripping balls on some kind of uh, hallucinogenic trip or something. I looked over, and, uh, and the guy next to me looked like a, a Sega Genesis character by the name of Earthworm Jim. I don't know if you're familiar with it. I was like, Jesus, I made a video game from the 90s. Anyways, this song is called, uh, it's called Savannah. The, uh, the girl that I met at the bar, uh, or at that party, her name was Kavanaugh, and she was supposed to take care of me that night. Um, but she did not, so I wrote this song the next morning called uh, Cab, I thought her name was Cabana, so I wrote Cabana, and Cabana's not her name, so Savannah is what I called her. Anyways, one, two, three. Have you any shit if you want to. Let's move around a little bit, man. I like how we're doing something. Come on now. Woo! Come on. You don't got to be fun to move? They got me dressed up in an old black suit, but every time I had some sailor home dudes, I need a shame for I'm looking too cool. I'm doing things I tell, I touch, I feel, I 